While Simon, Nicole and Jack are exploring another beach on beautiful Hinchinbrook, I've taken time out to just very quickly tidy the boat up and show you how I survive over a month on the boat. Starting with up the front, there's Nicole and Jack's bed. Their accessories and bedding are on the sides. Up high, there's our blankets. Sleeping bags up in the V-berth. Some more of their bedding sheet is that blue and green striped rolled. And then under that other blue pocket is our bedding. Their schoolwork is also behind there in um, cabinets. Then moving further down the boat, there's our table where we dine. Over here is my area and my bed, which of course is a lounge during the day. And a little shelf with knickknacks and books, sunscreens, sticky tape. As we move around towards the back of my my lounging area is all our cro crockery and our cutlery and a cabinet. Down below is our uh, drawers with um, cutlery and odds and ends. Further down is the bags and spinnaker and sails and some extra towels. I'm inside, which looks extremely neat, includes the VHF, our photography, books, tissues, binoculars, and of course, very important, the hats. There's his bed, looking very neat. Our dining table, which also is our centre board. Below is fuel, water, and our wet bag. So there you have the basics of the inside of the boat. Fruit, of course, onions, our lights, telephones, and very important glasses are above the dining table. And then as you come outside, very important, our netting with pegs, more sunscreen, our GPS on this side, more pegs, hats, and odds and ends like gloves. Then the rest of the boat, we put our fishing rods towards the back. And our fishing reel, drinks, cordial, 